There are people in this world who can find a ray of hope in our darkest hour of despair. Where does it hurt you? Come on, Holland, talk to me. My name is Specialist Stephen McGowan. Stephen McGowan joined the Army in the tsunami of emotion that flooded this country after 9-11. He thought his country was in danger, and he wanted to do his part. Stephen was barely out of basic training when war exploded in Iraq. Stephen stepped forward and said, I'll go so that others wouldn't have to. He called me, said, Mom, it took me three days to make this phone call. I volunteered to go to Iraq. He said, my roommate has a three-year-old son, and I think I should go before men who are married and have children. McGowan made children his personal mission in Iraq, even though he was a medic in a scout group that saw action and atrocities almost every day, he found beauty and hope in the faces of the children. He just said to me that one Christmas, don't send me anything, just send me some things I can give to the children. The easiest toys to carry on missions were Beanie Babies. Stephen started handing them out to Iraqi children. All right, first one to the right here. And the story quickly spread of the Beanie Baby Soldier. Little did I know that I would be inundated with Beanie Babies. The Beanie Baby Soldier started getting letters and Beanie Babies from American.